Welcome everyone to Heavy Rain Chronicles. Don't understand why it's called Chronicles, seeing as there's only one, which is the Taxidermist, which is two years earlier before you actually meet her in the regular game as she's investigating someone who might be the Origami Killer. So if you guys haven't checked out the very first I mean, not the very first, but if you guys haven't checked out my regular series for the Heavy Rain, there'll be a link in the description down below for you guys to go check out, as this is a DLC content for the game. And I'm just super stoked for it. It's a, I, I hear it's very short, like maybe 30 minutes or so, so let's check it out. Madison Page. Madison, it's Sam. I got the information you asked for. The guy's name is Leland White. He used to be a taxidermist, 40 years old, single, Apparently out of work for the last two years. No criminal record, no psychiatric history. A taxidermist? That's pretty original. You got his address? I'd like to ask him a few questions. His last known address was 411 Harbor Street, Lexington. You really think this guy could be the origami killer? The only way to find out is to go and ask him. If it's not him, he'll give me some tips on how to stuff animals. And he is the killer. And we've got the scoop of the year. Shit, you're really nuts. That's why you like me. Be careful, Madison. You never know. Don't worry. I'll be fine. Tuesday, November 3rd, 4.15 p.m. I'm at the home of the suspect Leland White. Leland White. Uh-oh. Oh, I thought it froze for a second. I was going to say, what the heck? Right, you got to press R2 and all this weird stuff. I should have played this, like, right afterwards, but I don't know why I put it off for so long. As if we're just checking his mail. Catalogs from women's clothes. Mr. White seems to be interested in fashion. It's kind of creepy. And doesn't seem right. But hey, we are a journalist, so we got to investigate in the most awkward ways ever. So I'm not going to quite go in just yet. I want to see if there is anything over here. There's probably not. I mean, there's just some barrels. There's a guy back there. Awesome. And there's obviously the two people over just sitting in the rain. Why is everyone sitting in the rain? Like, it's raining. Get inside. Okay, so let's actually just... Let's go check inside. Fuck it. We're going to go check inside, and we're going to see lots of stuffed animals, and it's going to be awesome. Oh, there's kids. Hi, kids. Should we take a peek at the window? Oh, we can. Ooh. That window is disgusting. It kind of looks old, too, because the very first shot we saw, there was what appeared to be just lots of newspaper on the, the top window there. All right, so we'll knock one more time. Hello? Hello? Oh, we're just going to check if it's open. Anybody home? Mr. White? Well... Oh, uh, let's see. There's an owl. That's cool. Hello? Hmm. Maybe we do have to go in the back. It's kind of weird. Well, like I said, it doesn't even look like anyone actually lives here, so... Oh, we can actually go in the backyard over here. I guess the other side was just fenced off. Okay. So that makes a little bit of more sense. But again, I still find it awkward that we're just in broad daylight, just walking around people's backyards, where clearly the neighbors must know that we're not part of this neighborhood. A window. It's a jar. No, it's a window. It's not a jar. Looks too high for me to be able to get in that one. Oh, but what if we grab this, huh? And then we come lifted. There we go. What the hell's in there, kerosene? Just that friggin' heavy? Oh, great. It looks like up here is just Not boarded off. Trying to get in there. I guess the door's locked anyway. Okay, well, we're cold. Let's get inside. Obviously, the only way we know of. Can we do it now? 
Um, or not? What the hell? Why do we lift that up if we can't even... Oh, can we just... Ah, I see. There we go. Come on! Roll it over, baby! Roll it over. Awesome. We're getting there. We're getting there. One more. And... Yeah! Come on, Madison! Be the strong, independent woman you are! Look at that. There we go. Now, could we possibly get inside? Shit. Sam is right. I really am crazy. <laughs> yeah, you're fucking breaking in. Alright, so let's not try and, like... Break it or anything. There we go. Again, <laughs> I... I'm gonna say that there's probably... He's probably dead or something. Oh god, please don't fall. Well. It's a good thing we just got in. I'll just have a quick look. Take a few photos and get out of here fast. But what exactly are we going to be looking for? I mean, there's like an option for quite literally everything here. Flour. We can make some pancakes. Nothing. I, I, I'm I going to assume that this place is just like straight up empty. Women's jewelry. Dozens of necklaces and bracelets. Strange place to keep them. Maybe he's taxidermying people. Huh? Kind of, that'd be a cool story to uncover. Just a lot of cleaning supplies. Oh, it's still running. We're going to leave everything open and just everything on, too. We're just that dickish of a person. Tons of cereal. More, wait, that's just lour. That's not even flour. That's just straight up lour. The hell can you make it with lour? Oh, like look at that! Like, what is that? Is that stuffing or just like dust that build up? Whatever it is, it just looks disgusting. Okay, is there anything over meow? Oh, look! Look at that big fish! Oh man, are we not gonna take interest in those cool-looking dogs? No. What's that? No, no, go back. All these birds, man. Tech, like, I, 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 I honestly, <gasps> no, shit, it's wings. Shit. <sighs> Great, Madison. Oh my god. Duh. Great. Now they are gonna know. That someone easily broke in. I mean, obviously, the open drawers and the sink that's left on is not a dead giveaway. So we're just going to sit here and wait. And just ponder. Just ponder. Hmm. Mr. White and I don't exactly share the same taste in interior decor. I don't think you. Like, who would share the same taste? Stink. Oh, I hate this place. It stinks of dust and death. Dust and death. This place gives me the creeps. Okay, well, we're, we're done sitting. We're done sitting. Again, what's with everything, like... Even the table just looks disgusting. Uh-oh. The remains of burnt clothes in the fireplace. Look like women's clothes. I really don't think I should be here. Did I hear something? I might be onto something. I honestly think I heard something, but I can't be for certain. Ah, yeah. Here we go. Rocking back and forth. How there can we go. Anybody live around all these dead animals? Well, I'm pretty sure you get used to it. All right, let's get back up. Enough rocking. Enough rocking. Uh, nope. We don't want to go over there. 
See, what is that? I gotta get out of here. I don't like the feel of it. Okay, this guy obviously works out, so we don't want to mess with him. He's gonna be a huge bro. Again, there's nothing in the bathroom. Cool. Oh, we should check in the fridge. See if there's like... Ew! Gee, you think I'm gonna find a story in the fridge? No, well, it's just an alcoholic. We're gonna leave that open. We're gonna rack up this guy's hydro bill. We're just that huge of a dick again. Okay, so let's go on upstairs. Again, I don't feel comfortable going up. All I see is just women's clothing and jewelry. Why am I here? I should keep going. I think I'm onto something. Oh. The floorboards creak when I walk on them. Ooh, gross. It's this creepy place. Oh, God. I'm afraid. Oh, basketball. Wait, what? The hell was that? I like how the basketball fell out of the first thing I do is like put back a broom. Okay, oh. Well, that's not too abnormal. I mean, we're in a ta taxidermy place, so. Yeah, you got all the, the utensils and everything there. Uh, just to like put everything back together and just glue on feathers and all that ish. Okay, so there's nothing in there. Let's go in, into this room over here. Open it up. Human remains, come on! Nope, not gonna open. Alright. Take a look outside. <gasps> Fuck that dog. I don't know why, but that dog scared me. I thought we were outside. Poor little otter. Oh, what's that smell? Probably someone dead. Animals. Oh my god, this is such a creepy place. Like, who would live here? Come on, turn around. Turn around, Madison. Oh, there's something there. But I guess you don't care about it. Women's things. Dozens of Dresses and suits. Dude, I bet you he taxidermied his wife. That's gonna be crazy. We're gonna unveil something gross. Come on. No! You're. Look! Oh, <laughs> I forgot how awkward the walking can be in this game. There we go. Uh. Something very. <laughs> Fucking knew it. In in the upstairs bathroom, a body in the bathtub. Um, she she um. Oh my god! Uh, with a saw. Well, I knew it. I knew that there's this place was. <gasps> is that someone walking? Or is that just me? Let's just let's just continue on, I guess. There's nothing to explore there. Oh, I fucking knew it. Please don't tell me that's a real human. That is freaking creepy. Jesus. Oh god, I knew it. I knew it. This is fucking weird. Yeah, let's take a picture of the, the, the corpses that are stuffed, but not the body in the bathtub. It's really creepy that they're just, like, posed like this. This time, I got my story. <sighs> Shit. Battery's low, of course, and I'm probably gonna have to call for the police. Yep, we're gonna do some exploring. Oh, like... That is messed up. Ooh. Can we turn off the TV? That's... I hate white noise. Hello! Okay, well, is there anything else? Ooh. 
Okay, so let's go back. Ah, uh, gross. See, should we, like, leave? Like, yeah. Shit, what am I doing here? I've got to get out of here before that psychopath gets back. Was there... There's nothing else we could check out here, is there? Yeah, fuck it, we're leaving. This is just too gross, too creepy. I've seen enough. Gotta get out of here and call the cops. Why don't you, I don't understand. <gasps> oh, fuck no. Oh, shit. <gasps> shit. Oh, God, I knew it. Well, if the owl wing doesn't give it away, everything else will. <laughs> floorboards creak. I gotta move quietly. These floorboards are gonna get me killed. Oh. The forecast cloudy and windy and cold this morning, warming up a bit. Oh, I don't know where I should go. Where should I even go? Oh, we seem to have a visitor. Oh fuck! Not good. A little weird. Not good. Sniffing round my little secrets. Fuck! <laughs> oh, this is no. Oh god! Oh god! The fucker's coming! Oh no no no! Fuck, dude! I fucked that up. I fucked that up hard. Go back, Madison! Go back! Oh, shit, dude. Oh, god damn. Come on, visitor. What is going on? Huh? No! Fuck! Oh, god. Oh, god. Oh. What? Kick him in the nuts, yeah! Oh god. Just jump over! Stop running, bitch! Okay. We're not tripping. We're not tripping. I'm the big bad. Oh my god! This is creepy! Oh shit, shit, shit. Damage the skin. Otherwise, it's no good. Fuck! I am just messing this up. This is not good. I'm too creeped out. Open, open. Open. Come on. This is not good. Fuck, I no. Okay. Well, I know I get away because I lived. This is two years prior. Come on. You bastard! Fuck, I keep forgetting to do... I keep thinking that's up. There we go. Come on. Just roll under. Run, 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 run. Get on your fucking motorbike. Come on. Just yell for help or something, dude. Oh. You're fucked out, taxidermist. He just killed himself, didn't he? 
Felix's investigation revealed the identity of the dangerous serial killer who stuffed his victims after killing them. Leland White was found dead in the circumstances that the police are currently investigating. That's messed up. That was a really quick episode, but goddamn, they got my heart pumping. Oh my gosh. And for those, obviously, I, I'm pretty sure the people who watch Heavy Rain are definitely watching this. Uh, Beyond Two Souls is coming out soon. You guys can expect me to play that because I love Quantic Dream. These guys make a fantastic game with very great story and character and just everything. Anyways, guys, I really hope you guys enjoyed this. I, I was terrifying. That was terrifying. Talk to you guys later. Peace out, Girl Scouts.